everyone, thanks for joining this video. Today we're going to talk about the best easy website builder on the market, and I think it's MightySites.com. So you're probably familiar with ones like this, Wix, or maybe you're familiar with Squarespace, or Shopify, or Webflow, or the dreaded WordPress. So all of these are website builders, but here's the deal. With Wix and with Squarespace, Shopify, I'm not sure about Webflow, but definitely with WordPress too, these website platforms are built to be really custom. So you can build pretty much any type of website that you want in terms of the template. Um, but there's going to be a lot of work that has to go into these website builders. So if you do want something really custom or you're trying to sell online and you want to use a website builder where it's really flexible, but you've got to do a ton of, you know, you're willing to put in the time and energy to kind of build it out then you can choose one of these website platforms. Uh, if you do go with WordPress, heads up, you're gonna have to pay for hosting, you're gonna have to have uh, get WordPress installed on a server, you're gonna have to upload and keep it up to date, and then if you start doing WooCommerce or something like that on the platform, you're gonna have a lot of maintenance costs that come around with it with time and money. So. Um, you know, that can run you anything from 50 to 100 bucks a month or even more if you have to get a web developer involved on a consistent basis. With some of these other platforms, there's nothing wrong with them. Um, so you can get started and you can build a website for your business or for yourself personally or whatever it is, especially if you want to sell online. But just know that when it comes to easy website builders, there is there's there are going to be places that you probably will get stuck and there are gonna be some, some time investment to get these built. So actually in the comments below, let me know how long it's taken you to build a website on one of these platforms and get set up. Because what I'm about to show you is Mighty Sites, which has, is only $9 a month. So again, if you actually go and look at the pricing for some of these, um, they start off free, but some of the things you're going to really want to use, you're gonna at least be probably thinking 16 to $22 a month. If you get into the business plans, you're looking at 32, 59, and then the enterprise plans are even more expensive. So that was Wix. Um, I think it's probably, I think it's similar for Squarespace. It just depends, but you can go ahead and actually let me know in the comments what you're paying for your, your uh, Squarespace website. That'd be really interesting too. Shopify has some good options. I think $29 a month is where it starts. It's a really great platform for selling online. Looks like they're doing a promo for the first three months of $1 and then it's $29 a month too. Uh, so that's pretty cool demo going on right now. But then again, as you graduate to more things, it's gonna get pretty expensive. Uh, with Webflow, Pricing is going to be similar. You got a kind of a free option, but as soon as you start getting into, so see, you, you have to use a webflow.io domain. Um, so that's that's one thing you're gonna be stuck right away. So you're probably gonna to wanna to jump to the $14 a month immediately. And it looks like the most popular is 23, and that's probably because it has the features that you actually want. Again, with WordPress, it's not just WordPress itself, which is free to download and upload, but you have to pay for hosting. And then again, there's gonna be apps that you're gonna need and things that you're gonna to have to pay for too. So all of these, you know, they're website builders, but are they easy? I'm not sure. And do they get expensive potentially quickly, depending on your budget? Uh, probably. So that's where Mighty Sites comes in. And you can see there are all these different types of themes for all these different types of local businesses mainly. And so if you are just looking for a, the best easy website builder, I think Mighty Sites is worth your time to try and check out because these other ones, again, let me know how long it takes you to build yours and how much you're paying for it in the comments. Um, but I'm gonna show you, it's gonna take me about five minutes and it's only $9 a month to build a website for pretty much any type of organization or local business using Mighty Sites. Again, it's not e-commerce, it's just having a simple web page online for your business. So uh, let me just show you how this works. Let's just say that, um, let's just say I have a handyman business. So that's right at the top. I would just search for the template, but you could also search restaurant. You know, there's generic templates, there's specific ones. So if you have like a local restaurant too, you can pick a theme that's specific to your restaurant type. But again, just to show you how easy this is, I'll pick handyman. And so it asks you for your name and your email address. And then the next thing it asks you for is company name. So again, it's built for, you know, businesses, uh, small businesses, local businesses who need a web page. So this easy website builder, I just type in like, all right, let's just call this Keegan's Handyman Business Denver, right? And then I'm gonna put in Denver, uh, Colorado, where I'm located, and then type of business that is a service if you're, if you're a handyman. So I'm gonna click continue. 
and nothing is easier than having your website generated for you, right? So if you look at what just happened with Mighty Sites, and again, this is why I think this is the best easy website builder, is because just by typing in my business information and a little bit of information about me, it automatically generated a nice professional website for Handyman. Now, if I want to, all to change colors, I don't have to deal with like color palettes and hex codes. I just click on this paint can and I can literally just click through all of these preset color palettes and just find one. And again, there's tons here, options for you, and just find the one that I prefer based on my brand, my logo, you know, what fits. It, and again, no matter what type of look you're going for, you can pretty much find a color palette that matches. So once that's done, I just click on any of these big update section buttons and they make it really easy to just add content to my site. So I don't have to deal with like a drag and drop editor or anything like that. I can just click through to the next thing. And let's just say I wanna put in my email address. So I'll add Keegan, mysites.com show email on the site. There we go. Let's add my phone number too. So I'll add my phone number right here. And there's my phone number. Let's say I want to link to my, you know, small business Facebook page. You can just go right here, facebook.com. And then I'll link to my page and I'll save that. There we go. Close. So now that's coming along nicely. If I want to update this section, I can go in here and, and update my menu just by adding a menu item that I want. So let's just say, you know, I want to add a menu and I'm going to type out here what it's called, new uh, nav item, and then I would select where it links to. So let's just say I want it to link to my about section, right? Confirm, add that to my menu, save, and now I've got a new new nav item right there. So that's really easy to do. If I want to update my logo, um, I can just go right here to this browse feature and let's just find a logo on my on my computer here so whatever logo you have for your business or your organization just find it and upload it and now i'm going to click save once it's uploaded and you can see this is built to be a really easy website builder because make it bigger make it smaller buttons appear right here and i just click on those buttons to change the size of my logo now if i want to get into more editing i click on this pencil and this website builder comes preloaded with all of these tools for editing pictures and logos. So you can just go through and edit anything you upload to the site really easily. I'm just gonna crop this down a little bit, get rid of some of the white space around the top and bottom. I think that works, click done. And now I'll just re-upload that, save my new logo, and you can see now it takes up a little bit more space. So I'll probably even make it smaller now. Um, so that was super easy to do. And then close it. You can see how quickly this website is coming together. Again, it's just point and click on the update section button. And I think that's what makes this the best easy website builder. If you really just want an easy to make website and maintain, uh, nothing can beat this. So let's just say I wanna edit this text, uh, renovate, you know, let's just say I prefer it, say it'll come preloaded with text and images that are all licensed for me to use for that $9 a month. But let's just say I want uh, to write this as handyman services right that's really easy to edit and then let's just say um, i want this to say request a quote i can do that now i can choose where this links so if i want this to link to a click to call i can do that if i want it to link to a different section of my website like the lead section i can do that click save and then if i up update this now if i actually click on this button it brings me right here to the lead form so that's really easy to use same thing with any of these, this text or other buttons. Let's just say um, that I want to add my phone number here. Go in, add my phone number to the site, save it, add my email, have that show up on the top of the website. So once those things are loaded, all my location information saved, and go down here. Let's just say that I want this, uh, this section to, uh, instead of contact us, maybe I want this to be call me. And then I can choose where that links and one of the action items will be click to email or it can be click to call my business. I can confirm that and save as soon as I close that. Now, if somebody's viewing this on a mobile device, they just click on that. It'll automatically call my business. And a lot of people are going to view your website on mobile. So you can see if I just scroll through, this whole website is built to be simple and easy to use on a mobile device. So that's what the view looks like there as well. Now, if I scroll to any of these sections, I can easily edit any of the pre-written copy and I'm free, free to use the images as well. So I can go down here, just say, this is the best easy website builder. 
and then I can save that and you can see whatever I type just shows up right here. So it's a point and click editor, which makes this really easy to use. And then I can use some of these tools, like I can bake it uh, in bold or italics just to help it show up better on the site. So any of this is really easy for me to edit and control. And then most of the templates, just depending on your business type, will actually come with a, uh, a lead generation form too. So if it's a service business, I can just go ahead and type in here my name and email and my phone number and then my message. Uh, again, I'll just go with this is an easy website builder, exclamation point, and then click send. And you can see the customer or potential customer will just get a message there saying your message has been sent and then you can click on stop editing at any time. You can scroll through and see what your website looks like without those update section buttons. And then you can actually go back to the site dashboard. And this is where you actually will get an email with your leads and things. So you can see one new lead. This is where I just submitted my information. So your website is, is ideally your online business card and that's where you'll be using it to market your business and attract leads for your small business. That's how you can you know, manage those leads. You'll get an email and you'll have a dashboard there with, with all the leads that have come through. Now, if I go to update again, I can just simply go back here at any time, make updates to the site. Um, and again, I'm using the, the handyman template, but each template's a little bit different. I'll go into connected domain. And if you have a domain from someplace like Google domains, GoDaddy, things like that, you just paste it in here and then it'll provide you with a set of simple instructions uh, to share with your registrar, which, uh, which will let you make the connection to use a custom domain. And again, that's not priced out like it is um, at the higher levels for some of these other platforms. It's just included right there. So if you are looking for a super easy to use website builder, this is it. You can deploy a website and be done in literally a few minutes. Uh, I think that makes it the best easy website builder. Now, these other website builders definitely have more tools and customization op options and things like that, but you're gonna be spending more time and more money to make those things happen. So it kind of falls out of that category of, of really truly being an easy website builder. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Click on the link and give this a try. Again, it's only $9 a month and there is a free trial. Best of luck with your business and building your new website.